Hello Scorpios and welcome to your weekly reading for August 8th. Um, thanks for um, all the good reviews I got last week, um, especially with my coffee cup readings. So if you haven't checked those out, go and I will be posting the new ones this week. So that will be tomorrow. So check those out. I have been posting now um, daily birthday readings. So check those out too. Um, that's about it for now. So let's go on and see what your week ahead brings for August 8th. Oh, Scorpios. Okay, Scorpios, the sense I'm getting there are profound endings and new beginnings. That's what I'm seeing the theme of the week here. Yep. Okay, let's get on with your reading. So what you're coming in with is the tower and that coming in is powerful transformations strong um i'm feeling endings are coming up total endings total chapters a new life all life altering changes is what i'm feeling is coming in and you got the six the six of hearts this is showing harmony compromising i think you're feeling more generous this week um more giving with other people or someone significant so that's the feel i get on that one then you got the king of clubs i feel this is someone a friend of yours or a partner or someone who's trustworthy could be even a parent um a father i mean it doesn't have to be a man but i feel there's someone maybe around you that is also just as compromising giving or your um, generous or you're just enjoying each other's company that's a sense i'm getting or he's there or she is there to, to help you. Then we have the Ace of Clubs. Ace of Clubs is, I do see a lot of creativity in the card. So um, it's telling me there your creative juices are really high and you may find a hidden talent you have. You know, this friend may come in and even, may have not even realized something or you might even do something with it. It's also telling me that you may receive a message, a phone call, letter, text, email, you know, the way it is these days. So that you may be um, hearing something too soon. With the Jack of Clubs, this is usually good news. Um, if you're single, that may be a, you know, a lover or have someone you've been separated for a while is coming back or hearing good news but um i think it's connected to a message that possibly usually this card is good but at what i'm feeling here that you may be getting some emotional news and it may not be the best um it's going to touch you profoundly in an emotional sense that's what i'm sensing um with the jack of uh, hearts this week because here you have the ace of the ace of spades this is a profound ending it's like a it's like a death a total um that's the sense i'm getting with the tower and that, that this card is telling me there is a death like situation um possibly someone passing hearing a song passing or there it's it's profound Finally, an ending, a death to a situation or a phase in your life, and your life is like totally changing. Um, total life altering experiences are coming with the Ace of Spade. Um, definitely an end and or death and rebirth, you know. So it could denote message coming in because you have the Ace of Clubs here too. Possibly some news. Um, someone may have passed, um, but. 
it's a profound ending that is showing up. And then you have the Queen of Spades. Um, I don't like this person. I wouldn't trust her. It's a master manipulator. Maybe you will, um, you'll, and you may even end a relationship with this person or, um, friend, whatever this person, whoever it is that signifies in your life. But that's a good thing anyway. That's definitely with the ace of spades there too. So it could be a death to the situation, like a total divorce, um, death, um, ending or, um, you're just done. And that's good. Um, when you hear news about her, you know, I'm not going to even say it. You know what I said before. <laughs> had to put it out there but i would not trust this person and i think you know not to trust this person and definitely um there's either it looks like there's could there could be an ending with this person anyway and it's a good thing i don't like this the sense i'm getting of this person totally is a manipulator malicious can't trust this person i think you i think you know that yourself too so or whatever it is, the situation in your life, it could be something internal that you know yourself. I hope it's not you, because sometimes these do show on us, and maybe there's things that you need to change about yourself. But um, this is what I'm skinning out of this card. Now, the underlining theme of the week is the Three of Spades. Um, three of Spades. Yeah, there's definitely a ending, um, profound endings this week, and there it's it's sad that there's some sadness there could be some tears um there could be the new a, a news of death coming in that would make you a little sad or that but um or also there's the, the when you were going through profound changes in our life and life altering experiences they can be sad even if they're good you know it's like just say you great house and you always want to move but and you're leaving a small place and then you move into this house and you're like you're still sad because it's like you grew up in this small little apartment or whatever it is and there's all these memories even though you're in a better place than that but it this is what i mean changes sometimes they're always hard good or bad changes it's human nature we have a hard time adjusting to change so that's what i'm seeing for this week but i'm going to pull a tarot card too See what it's this an adds to this. Okay. The eight the eight of rods here. Eight of wands, same thing. What I'm picking up here is it's telling me major crossroads in your life. Major crossroads. Important news. Definitely important news is coming in and information. And I think um, it's coming in fast and you and you probably have to jump on it. It's like you snooze, you lose type of thing or the changes that are coming in, you need, to, you can't just sit on them. You're going to have to make some decisions. And it's, it, I see a crossroads in, in your life coming in. Also with all these cards, these profound endings, um, death rebirth situations or whatever you want to say. And you know, this, this is a reading for so many Scorpios out there. Um, it, it can apply in different ways. It may not, you know, um, also it's, it's really good to watch your moon sign, your rising. Cause sometimes those are more, you know, external forces sometimes work on us more one week. Sometimes the emotions do more. Sometimes our sun sign, but the sun sign will always um, say something. And anyway, um, I also feel there is some good news. You know, there's a blessings in disguise. Uh, they could be some, like I said, changes. But the thing is, it's what's saying to me is, where are you going to go with all of it it's a crossroads coming in and with all these cards what they're speaking to me that's exactly what this card is telling me so scorpio that is your reading for the week and i hope you have a fabulous week change is great i'm telling you you know no matter what um we always look back and say good or we learn from it you know that's life but you know, everybody's life has is, is a roller coaster ride. We all have ups and downs. 
just say someone's lucky in love and you're always saying, you know, this person's lucky in love. Well, you may have something that person is lacking too. So it balances out. But we all have our fair share in everything in life. So you know that. Um, please like, share, and subscribe this video. And um, if you didn't check out my coffee cup readings, check them out tomorrow. I'm going to be posting them. Also, um, if you want a private reading, go on my about section and you'll see the information for that there. I do have a donation section um, too that you can donate if you want me to keep putting this um, free stuff up. Um, also, the proceeds will be going to I'm um, wanting to open up a shop and to a, um, a center for sexually abused victims and domestic violence too and i will make a video on that later i just wanted to mention that anyway scorpios have a wonderful week and see you next week for your next weekly reading thank you